How to make a Thanksgiving cornucopia. Latin for horn of plenty, a cornucopia makes a colorful centerpiece for holiday meals. You will need a large tray or cookie sheet, assorted leaves, real or fabric, a two foot long wicker cornucopia available at most craft stores, three eight ounce bags of raffia or straw, gourds, crab apples, Indian corn, miniature pumpkins, pomegranates, and artichokes, walnuts, cranberries, and ribbon for a bow. Optional, mums. Step one, place a large tray or cookie sheet on a table. Step two, scatter colorful autumn leaves, real or fabric, over the tray and set the cornucopia on top of the foliage. Step three, line the bottom of the cornucopia with straw or raffia. Step four, place the larger fruits and veggies inside the cornucopia first to serve as a foundation for the smaller ones. Produce with shiny, waxy skin, gourds, pomegranates, miniature pumpkins, artichokes, crab apples, and Indian corn will stay fresh longest. Step five, continue filling the cornucopia with the smaller fruits and veggies. Let some spill out onto the tray. Step six, sprinkle walnuts and cranberries over the arrangement, allowing them to fall into the nooks and crannies. Step seven, tuck in any leftover leaves. Fresh mums can be inserted on Thanksgiving. They will last all day. Step eight, tie a big bow at the base. Did you know? The modern ice cream cone was unveiled in 1904 at the World's Fair in St. Louis, where it was called the World's Fair Cornucopia.